What's up? I'm in Chiang Mai, Thailand. A place called Doi Tep or Soi Doi Tep. I'm terrible at these pronunciations. I'm walking up straight verticalness. Yes. So this is at the top of Mount Chiang Mai. No, I'm just kidding. I got a little lost coming here. Mr. Uh, BJ Motorcycle Deed told me that all the police checkpoints so had vigilantly avoided them. And uh, got here all right, got a little lost. That was a nice trick. All I wanna do is skateboard here. But I couldn't bring it on my flight. It's a rubbing bell for good luck. It's like Buddha's belly, but it's got some red duct tape. Coming up on the view. Look at that. We got all these bells. It's set somewhere here. Yeah. Okay, verdict is the name of it is Doi Sui Tep. I believe that's how it's pronounced. 30 baht to get in, but you can pretty much sneak in if you want to, not too hard. Um, there is a kind of a temple thing at the top you gotta take your shoes off for and wear appropriate clothes, but everything else I don't think it matters too much what you wear as long as you're not bearing anything that you wouldn't want your mama seeing, if that makes sense. Um, the other thing about Thailand is you gotta watch out for these wires. They can close on you if you aren't paying attention. Lots of low electrical wires. Uh, another thing I forgot to mention is I got free gas in my motorcycle. The dude didn't fill it up when I bought it, or when I rented it, which I was kind of expecting. But then I pulled in the gas station, these French people were like, hey, use the rest of our gas that we paid for. And hooked it up. This is a bad boy, I'm blocked in. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon. I'm at Mysaw Waterfalls, and uh, the heat is kicking in. It is uh, probably about 90, 11.45 in the afternoon, and I just got here. Uh, it's 20 baht to get a motorcycle in here and 100 baht per person, and it looks beautiful. It looks like a fun place to explore. Looks like there's even tigers out here. Uh, so this is uh, the third waterfall. Um, and there's ten in all according to the signs. This is pretty killer. I mean, there's not a lot of places like this in the United States where it's just a one long waterfall and you just keep hiking and seeing more of it. Some say this is bad luck, but it's good for your limbo skills. I think you can maybe slide down or never mind.
It was dangerous. Uh, looks like that's the end of the trail. So hopefully this is a good swimming area. I saw a couple places that look good to swim, but none that where you could like jump in a really good rock. Heading back down the trail. Some dogs were following me for a little bit. Um, trying to wait till dusk so the cops don't see me, but judging by how this works, maybe it's better to go when the sun is blinding people in the face. Ah, yes, going back to Vietnam. We'll see how this goes. Chiang Mai was exceptional. Kind of tired from staying on crappy bunk beds. I'll see you on the other side. Oh my god. I'm in Da Nang. This is a huge dragon bridge. Just absolutely beautiful. Oh, it's just beautiful here. There's lots of bridges and this um, big river in the middle of the city. Beautiful day, temperatures probably high 70s, about 4 p.m. I'm just loving it here. Uh, it's too bad there's not a lot of teaching options here, or else I would totally put up camp and try to try to get a job here. But. I uh, haven't seen too many things posted. Um, I haven't really filmed much, I've just kind of been enjoying it. There is a huge beach here. I had no idea that it's such a, a kind of beach vibey town. I was thinking it would be way more of a um, smaller version of Hanoi. I think it's a population of about one million. Just really fantastic. Uh, rented this cruiser bike which I had a very difficult time securing. It took me about two hours to find one. They will rent you motorcycles here easily. Any mom and pop shop, just anyone will rent you a motorcycle. But getting a, a bicycle was really difficult, which is surprising because there's this huge, sort of like a boardwalk strip that goes along probably at least 10 kilometers of the beach, if not more get a cruiser board or a cruiser bike and cruise along and go surfing and have a good time.